that is based on uh, a best-selling book though yeah. uh, did you kind of like read the books as kind of a part of the research yeah or? I'll be honest I didn't read the book and it was I wanted to but yeah. um, it was kind of on purpose uh, I wanted to base my version of Jack Caffrey off yeah. of Megan Gallagher's screenplay as opposed to um, Mo Hader's version I know there were some differences between the screenplay and the book oh, okay. um, my mum however read the book before I'd even got the job and oh, uh, right. she's very eager <laughs> and has now read the whole series. Yeah, good mum. So, um, I mean, she was always filling me in with certain details and similarities or differences between oh, the book brilliant. and the script. Yeah. Nice. Yeah. Uh, we saw in the clip that we watched there, Iwan Rayon is also in it. Yeah. Um, who, of course, was with you as well on Game of Thrones. Was this a nice little reunion? It's, uh, it's been an absolute bonding. A real... <laughs> a Cymru bonding. With, with you and, and with Sasha, they're amazing. When we, when we started this, I thought, those two guys, in my part of the storyline, because they're not all they seem, they're, they're bad ones, OK? I'm sorry if I'm giving anything away here now, but w what can I do? And they... It, it borders on really dark humour as well, and that's a, that's, a, that's, a, that's a hard one to pull off. Yeah. And when we did the read-through, I knew... I knew these guys were going to be just brilliant. And I was so proud of, of you. And <laughs> you can't help it mm. with that, that Welsh connection. Yeah, yeah oh, brilliant. Nice. Uh, Ukraine, it's not the first crime drama you've been involved in, either, is it? Uh, he's involved in the BBC uh, drama uh, Annika, yep. uh, Blind Spot, which is also in the US. Yeah. So, what is it about this particular role that kind of really draw, draws you in, kind of gets those juices flowing? Um, for me, I think it was the, the substance in the role. I think Jack is such a a complex and multi-layered character. He's yeah. not a typical white knight hero. You know, he's, uh, he's got some issues and some, <laughs> some things he's struggling with, but I think that all compels him and fuels him on to, to help people and to save the vulnerable. You yeah. know? Mm, I can't wait to see it. Mm. We mentioned, of course, Line of Duty. Um, is it right, Owen, that, that people still want to talk to you yeah. about the end? Oh, they, they, they want to tell me <laughs> that, I'm, that they don't believe in the H and that it was my character. And I said, but you watched, you've clearly watched it. And they say, yeah, yeah I don't care. <laughs> I, said, I, don't, I don't know what else I could do. If I had Jed Mercurio's number, I'd yeah. give him a call. But, but how brilliant are they that invested? It's, it's a me. I mean, that, that really did capture, didn't it? You know, the, yeah. the nation and um, uh, it's such a joy to be, as an actor, part of something that has that impact. Mm. Yeah, it, what more do you want? Definitely. It's not done. It's, not done. it's, it's still something left in there, <laughs> definitely. I'm waiting for it. Um, thank you both. Wolf starts a week today at 9 o'clock on BBC One and iPlayer, and you can catch up on Annika and Line of Duty on iPlayer 2.